what's going on youtube welcome back to my channel it's your boy jim graphics so in today's video i'll be sharing with you a little tip on how to search an already used font in any design okay um a lot of us find it difficult to locate an already used font on any design sorry guys this is not my work i didn't get i didn't design this okay as you can see the picture i just grabbed from the internet boy somebody's job kudos to the graphic designer who did this all right so um I'll just show you guys how to um, get the fonts and already use fonts in any design of your choice, okay? So let's assume we want to get this font, alright? The every Sunday font, alright? So if you see it in any design and you like the font and you want to make use of it, you kind of, oh wow, I love this font, I want to make use of it. This is how to get that exact font, alright? Or you can get something similar to that and sometimes 100% you get exact fonts, alright? So Let's get to it. So what I'm going to do now is come over to my crop tool. All right. We're looking for this font, the every Sunday font. All right. So what we're going to do is just crop out this part. All right. So crop it using your crop tool. You can use any application to do this. All right. Or any software. Sorry. So what you're going to do is export this image. Use Control E to export. All right. We're going to just maybe fonts. Alright, so I'm going to export this as fonts, come back to your column mode, put it as RGB, alright. So once you do this, now we have exported our fonts, okay. So what we're going to do now is I'm going to come over to this website called myfonts.com. I'm going to put the link in the down description below. So what we're going to do is if you open this website, this is what you're going to see, alright. So come over to this section, you can see instant font identification powered by the world largest collection of fonts okay so i'm not actually advertising this website it's actually the website i used mostly to locate certain fonts i want to use okay so if you come to this section you will see drop an image here to identify the fonts or click here to upload image okay you can actually upload jpeg or png don't forget guys what we exported initially from our current draw was a jpeg file Alright, so just click on this on this spot here and locate where you saved it. As you can see, I have exported like multiple of it. So let's say I export. Okay, let's click on any of this. Alright, so it will bring itself to this place and um, just wait for it to load. Alright guys, so once it's done loading, you will see a section that will pop up here. So we're up and this is what we're going to have. So you can see this um, node here. We call this node in current row, but I don't know what it's called here, but I'll call it node. Alright, so you're going to use this and select only where the font is. Alright, select this. Once you just place this, alright, so come over to this um, arrow, um, sorry, this arrow pointing to the right and click on it. Alright, so wait for it to search for the font and... Um, Alright, so mostly the fonts here are not free. So but I'll teach you how to get the fonts. Okay, so how to get fonts, how to get fonts. This is what we are looking at today. And boom guys, as you can see we have different fonts, different fonts, different fonts here. As you can see, this is the font we are searching for. And these are the names over here. These are the names. We have this, we have this. So you can select any one of these. Let's say, okay. These ones are going um, exactly with what we're looking for, all right? So if you have money to buy, $20, $25, you can buy. But let me show you some basic trick of which you can get this font. All right, guys. So what we're going to do is basically locate any of this. And these are the names, as I said earlier. These are the names. So what you're going to do is just select a name here, all right? Just select the name and copy it. Select it this way, copy. Then come to to a new tab then paste it click on enter all right so once you do that just locate the name we have sql sans font all right so just click on it and wait for it to load all right so once you download it this is the font you're looking for once it's downloading just click on download all right so click on download and wait for it once once it's downloading it will start download okay i think the network is done here Alright, so to start downloading, 
waiting for it to download is done so what you're going to do is come over to your downloads all right so you can see it here open it and um open the font and um, this is your font here all right these are all the fonts so what you're going to do is basically you can you can install it one after the other or you can basically come over to this and create a folder and name it fonts all right so once you name it so let me close this and put this inside this folder and open it this way all right so these are the fonts all right so these are the fonts let's get the second one so once you open this folder all right all you need to do is just select all and right click then click on install for all users and it's installing okay so it's installing to your system all right so you can come over to the second one i guess they are all the same so they are all the same here so because if you click on any of this and say install it will tell you it has already existed so so this is the font we're looking for so if you come to correct draw now if you come back to your correct draw all right if you come back to your correct draw and type every sunday all right if you type every sunday the name of the font we search was sql So this is the font here guys this is the font we just installed as you can see so this is the name of the font we have so if you just break this apart and bring this here as you can see guys we have the same fonts as we exported all right so guys this is how to get your fonts in anywhere any font you see around you and you want to get them so this is how to get them so don't be confused guys don't say that this is not right because um this thing you're seeing here is was actually manipulated this way all right so as you can see we've gotten the same thing we got here so it's just the same as getting any font same process you can use it to get any fonts of your choice anywhere you see them all right guys so thank you for watching this video and stick around this channel don't forget to subscribe give it the thumbs up if you love this video if you get anything good in this video guys don't forget to give it a thumbs up thank you guys for watching this video and see you guys in my next video